Hi everyone, this is Antolito, and today we'll review the P-38F Lightning. Patch 1.3 brought us this brand new US Heavy Fighter. Now, for a Heavy Fighter, the Lightning is extremely capable. Take the speed of the BF-219V, take the climb rate of the 109E, take the highest optimum altitude in Tier 5, now add in the highest dive speed in Tier 5, uh, add the second highest optimum airspeed in Tier 5, and add the highest roll rate for any heavy in Tier 5. Once you add that all in together, you get the best heavy fighter in Tier 5. For every characteristic that makes a heavy fighter successful in World of Warplanes, the Lightning is either the best or the second best in Tier. In fact, its performance characteristics are so good, you can even outperform a good number of Tier 6 planes. The Lightning's performance as a heavy fighter is unmatched. It has the speed and vertical capabilities to perform boom and zoom in both the horizontal and vertical fashion, and has plenty of firepower. The guns on this consist of four 50 caliber machine guns and one cannon. Now, best of all, all five of those guns are located in the central hub, meaning you've got a lot of firepower with less dispersion than you would expect. You'll deal enormous damage at close and medium range. Once you get within 400 meters or so of a target, all five of your guns are going to hit and do incredible damage. The only drawback to the firepower is the single cannon configuration means you don't have a whole lot of power at long range, which also means you should be careful when performing head-on attacks. Head-on engagements will often end up in you actually ramming your opponent because you need to get so close before your guns deal a lot of damage and contrast that with most other heavies in game that have lots of cannons that can deal damage far out and win head-on engagements before you conduct a ram. But really, that's a very small drawback and a very small knock against this plane that's otherwise very capable of doing everything a heavy fighter should. Your central cannon choices do does include a 37mm derp cannon, so if you really like to take long-range shots and one-hit kills, you can equip the derp cannon but I would stick with the 20 millimeter cannon in your central hub, especially because the muzzle velocity is almost exactly the same as the 50 caliber machine guns, meaning all five of your guns will be extremely easy to put on target and they will hit at the same time. All in all, this is the ideal heavy fighter for tier five and even if you get into a tier six match, you're still extremely competitive. The only word of caution for flying the lightning is not to go too low in altitude. You are a heavy fighter, so you will turn like a boat if you fly down too low. So make sure to win the high altitude first and clear out other high altitude fighters before you drop too low. Finally, you'll notice that I'm running the rocket pods on the Lightning. Uh, the rockets themselves only have a 45 meter blast radius, which isn't ideal, but you do get 12 of them, allowing you to rack up some rocket kills very nicely with this plane. At the end of the day, you're looking at arguably the best tier 5 fighter in game. Thanks for watching and happy hunting.